This amazing AI not only creates hyper-realistic images and stunning videos, but it might even help you find your soulmate all in one platform. Souljin is a newcomer in this industry, but its power is truly incredible. Let me show you what it can do. I've never introduced this tool on my channel before, but now it's time. You can find the access link to Souljin in the description if you're curious to try it. First, we'll review all its cool features and tools. Then I'll generate some real output so you can see the quality for yourself and decide whether it's worth trying. Before we dive in, this is AI Border, and I make videos for you every day to keep you updated in the tech world. So hit that like button, and if you think this cat is cute, write cute for me in the comments. This short video will show you exactly what kind of world you can create with just a single image. From hyper-realistic faces and smooth, fluid videos to professional and creative edits. Ready? So, let's experience the magic of Souljen together. You can create a portrait of anyone you want to resemble. You just upload one face photo and Souljen practically recreates the same person with high accuracy and completely consistent, stable characters. You can change anything, hairstyles, colors, clothes, or even remove unnecessary parts entirely. Everything is under your control. Want to complete a cropped or incomplete image? With the outpainting feature, Souljen generates the missing details for you and creates a full, natural looking image. Now, here's the next part. You can even create your real soulmate with imagination. You've already seen some tools like this on my channel, so this one does the same thing, but even more. It's not just about creating your soulmate, it's also about making videos and everything else in between. And here's how you do it in three steps. You just log into your account, write your description or prompt, and then generate it. So it's almost self-explanatory. This tool also has an interesting and admittedly slightly controversial feature. You can generate NSFW content. Obviously, I can't show such content on YouTube, but I'll explain how it works. Also, it has a mobile app and you can use it directly on your phone, which I think is super convenient. Okay, now let's dive into the interface and see exactly how it looks. First tool, character creation. You can make anything from realistic faces to anime style characters. Choose your favorite style and just write the prompt. For example, I'll write something simple, a smiling woman. The cool thing is, if you have no idea what to create, Souljen gives you suggestions and prompt improvements. For instance, you can just write picture and it will suggest several ideas. Some are even a bit bold or risky, but for now, we'll keep it simple. So we have a simple prompt, a smiling woman. You can, if you want, choose a reference image. This step is completely optional. You can either pick an existing image or upload your own. I'll just pick a random one for this example. Then you can select the image style, for example, visionary, realistic, or true. You can even and change the aspect ratio, 2 to 3, and choose the number of outputs, 1, 4, or 9 images. I usually pick 4 images. Finally, just click Create. Super simple and self-explanatory. I'll show you all the tools and how to use them. I've even gathered all my generated outputs in one place so you can easily view them all together. Second tool, image editing. This tool allows you to remove anything from an image. Super easy. Select an image. For example, I have a photo of Superman. Now you can remove specific objects. Let's say you want to erase the logo on his chest. Choose the model, select the number of output images, and finally click Remove Object. That's it. Generation speed. In most cases, it only takes a few seconds to get the output. In this example, the logo on Superman's chest was completely removed. So if you ever need to erase something from an image, this tool is super handy. Animation section. You can create a video right from here. Just click on animation, but we'll get to that in a moment. Outpainting. This feature is amazing. Let me give you an example. Select an image, now expand it by placing it in the desired position and writing what you want to add. For example, I wrote, a woman in a park. Set the outputs to four images and click create. The results are ready in less than a minute or two. Honestly, faster than anything I've seen so far. I didn't even finish my sentence and the new image was ready. So we clearly see that it's the same girl, but she's wearing different clothes in each picture and there's a park in the background. Perfect if you want to expand your images or add more details. Face swap section. Just pick a video. Then upload the face you want to replace. Choose the model. Standard, Advanced, or Advanced 2. I always recommend Advanced 2 because it gives the most natural results. Turn on the face option and click Create. The output is ready in just a few seconds and looks completely natural and believable. Human modeling section. This one is super fun because you can create a real looking character and place them in different scenarios. Upload a reference image. 
for example, the same girl I used earlier. Describe what she should be doing. I wrote, a woman walking in the park. Choose the desired resolution and number of outputs, for example, four images, then click generate. Generation time, usually 30 seconds to a minute. So you see the same girl, but now in different park environments. Some images look more natural and prettier than others, but they all perfectly match your prompt. After generating, you can download the images, or if you want to remove part of the background or add something new, you can use the editing tool again. Now we get to the most exciting part of SoulGen, video generation, which is why most of us are here, image to video section. You can upload a new image or select one you've already generated. For for example, I'll pick one of the images I just created and write a simple prompt, a woman talking and looking straight ahead. You can even use face swap here to change the face, but I'll keep it simple for now. Result, a short, realistic video of that exact image. Text to video section, you have two modes. One, tag mode, recommended for more precise results. Pick an image, set the gender, body pose, hairstyle, clothing, scene, hair color, and other details. SoulGen combines all these to create a personalized video for you. Two, text mode, for more creative freedom. Just write a prompt and let the AI and imagination do the rest. Video results, ready in just seconds. And the quality, especially for simple scenarios, is truly amazing. Okay, let's check out the results. Our first set, a simple classic theme, a smiling woman. I used a reference model and the result was really good. All the images looked great, even with some filters. They still had a natural and pleasant feel, a perfect example of how you can get interesting outputs from just a simple reference. And now, the more exciting part, another generation with the visionary style. I used a reference image again, and the result was stunning. Stunning. Four images, all with amazing details. Face swap in video. This is the same face swap we created earlier. As you can see, it's now exactly the same person from the photo, but she's dancing in the video. You can swap the face of any dancer, as long as you have permission to use the video. Result, no need to hire anyone to record a video for you. Just replace your face and have ready to post content for any platform. Human modeling. This is the same generation we made a while ago. Woman walking in the park. Maybe she doesn't walk 100% naturally, but overall the quality is good and there's a subtle filter that makes it look nicer. For such quick generation, I think the result is absolutely acceptable. Okay guys, check this out. I just used one reference photo in a super simple prompt, a woman talking, and the result, amazing. The same girl I created is standing there in a park, leaves moving behind her, and she's actually talking to us. Looks so natural, right? Then I tried something weirder. I took this guy and swapped his face. Honestly, I don't like it, but it's hilarious, so I had to show you. Next, I wanted to make the same girl look sad. I used the same reference image and got four results. First, second, third, and last. Honestly, they all look great. Which one's your favorite? Drop it in the comments. And this is just the beginning. This tool can do so much more and you've gotta try it yourself. This was literally my first video with it, and I'm already excited. Oh, and if you want to learn how to create AI images and videos, or even make $200 per video using AI, watch the video that's popping up on your screen right now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, see you in the next one.